Mariah, you here? No, no Mariah. Mariah. Just... Elvis, you here? Oh no. Oh, okay. Is Elvis either. here? Elvis oh. isn't here? Oh, oh my gosh. Really Everyone has left thing. the building. All right. Oh, what is that? That's a surprise. Oh, this is five. Five. Four. Three. Two. Live from Kahuna City, New Jersey, where our theater, the Count Basie, has only front row seats. <laughs> And we are always striving to solve New Jersey's three biggest questions. Camaro or Trans Am? Bench press or squat? Bruce or Bon Jovi? <laughs> Chelsea Arns is proud to present Chelsea Pearls. Hi. Hi there. You know, actually, the Count Basie doesn't have a bad seat. Hmm. I have been, I took the kids to see Weird Al, and we literally- Yankovic? Yes! <laughs> I'm gonna make you know that actually. I know random information. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty but weird. we sat in the last row of and the balcony and it was fine. We could see everything, oh hear God. everything. We had a ball. That's a so right. yeah, there yeah, are no bad seats it. at the Count AC. He just so you know. Now. Does he rap I now? I think so. I love him. We had so much fun. <laughs> we really did. I'm a little screwed up because today is Saturday. I know, it's not Sunday. August 4th. Sunday. No, Saturday. We're, we're, August we're 4th. usually podcast, but she has she has a um it's family, our family weekend. beach weekend mm -hmm. yeah and hopefully you have nice beach weather tomorrow uh hopefully so. hopefully we'll get some beach time in before we come back Although, today's a little rainy right now we don't have anyone to watch harley so i'm not really sure how this is gonna work out that might be i, I would offer but yeah, yeah no. he might eat my dogs <laughs> he would definitely eat and your my dogs. white furniture uh really? the white furniture would be a definite he wouldn't eat the furniture. He would just lay on it, kind of roll around, so it would have that coating <laughs> of black the hair when he was itchies. done. Yeah. I was hysterical when I was editing the podcast last week. I was rolling when, when you were like, and then we were talking about the itchies and Harley, and it was a riot. I know. Oh my I've been God. Benadryl, that was a good one. Which seems to help. I, I might. Benadryl has an adverse effect on me, though. It doesn't make me um, sleepy or anything. It makes me really congested oh isn't that weird that is weird it's weird that's really weird. what does i don't know i'm just talking anyway today's saturday we have a lot of good stuff here we because do have a lot of good stuff. i'm really excited first i'm i'm just too excited i have to give you a present <laughs> it's really not a big uh, deal because when tat says he's gonna give me a present i think i'm yeah, getting she, like a boat yeah, I can't tell <laughs> so this is because then i could show it up on the podcast so this is for you <laughs> And she's gonna be like, what? Okay, <gasps> now, we're totally copying Christy Glass and Leonette. And, well, mine's sparkly. <laughs> they didn't have a purple sparkly one, and I know you're not really, you like pink, but I thought we could have opposite. I had Chelsea yarn stickers made. Stickers? And wait. The Stop big it. kahuna. Oh, I can't wait. Isn't that oh awesome? God, that's so, exciting. so I Alex gave me a sticker when I was there last week and I asked him for a sticker, so I've been asking everyone for, for stickers. stickers. So I saw on Christie's glass uh Christie's glass. <laughs> that sounds funny, right? <laughs> on Christie Glass when they were going out the Pacific Northwest when they did that trip mm -hmm. and they had now jeans and everywhere they went they got stickers, stickers. and uh, if you a hike idea. a lot and Leah from um uh, the knitting garage. Right. Hers is sick. She's got stickers all over because she lives in, you know, Ryan, you know, Rhinebeck. So, so this is mine so far. It is sparkly. All right, podcaster gang See? song. It's sparkly. Oh yeah. And I have Alex creates, and there's the, oh, big, kahuna, the big kahuna, guy? and I have the yeah. Shelly Can yarn snob. So a few people have asked so far. Oh, I'm like, so excited. Yeah, isn't that awesome? Yes, thank you so, so much. So I'll give you, I have the stickers in the back. Yay. I can't wait. Yeah. This is so cool. So um, that was. Uh-oh, what's in there? The collagen. <laughs> Not again. Not again? Yes, I drink it every oh day. Gosh. Every day? <laughs> every day, yeah. Two teaspoons. Two. <laughs> Your face is priceless. Sandy, you can make noise and stuff, don't worry. Sandy's having a class. She's What's doing. Sandy wearing? That's really cute. Oh, that is really cute. I like that, Sandy. Thank you. What is it? It's um, I don't remember the name of the pattern, but it's, it's really from pretty. Prince and Co. Oh, really pretty. It's a linen top. It's really cute. Nice. She knits like two sweaters a week. Just no. saying. I wish. <laughs> Sandy's our teacher. But anyway. I'm so um, excited. So yeah, Except that's my collagen. collagen. <laughs> so while we were on the, the 
talking about Leah from Sickles, uh, the knitting garage. garage. Leah owns a store in, well, it's like a family owned run store in Rhinebeck called Stickles. Sickles. And Stickles. Stickles. And she's I always the, called Sickles because we have a store at Sickles. She's at the back. She's at right? the back. She has a yarn shop and it's so adorable. She's adorable. She made these bags and they debuted at the String Thing studio we missed that we that missed one. it. Wait, why did we miss it? We had something going on. I don't know. Was it there was a trunk a show or something maybe? I think we had a trunk show. I think so. I think I can't remember what I did yesterday, let alone two weeks, but I re we really wanted to go to that and we missed it. So Leah designed these ro huge Rhinebeck bags. How cool is this, babe? You have to that sign is. mine. And remember like when you were in high school and you would do the, Miriam's doing the bacon stare, when you would do the <laughs> signing of the yearbook and stuff, this is what you'll do with the bag. And it fits, she said, like 40 skeins of yarn. That so is. that's your that's like that's your right back home. Yeah, and right it there. comes with a sharpie on it. So I've linked it below here. in the last podcast. Miriam has hers now. I have. So I you can order it. now. It's all good because I have mine. <laughs> so I'll link it below. Where again this week where you can get it. You, if you're going to Rhinebeck, it's definitely a must-have. It's so cute. She's adorable. I actually had ordered a knitting garage pin from her a few months ago, or when she first had them, and I lost it. So I just I ordered another one. I wouldn't recommend putting enamel pins on here if you're going to Rhinebeck because they will fall off. Yeah, and you have to get those the special backs. I bought them on Amazon. I bought them too because I have lost a couple also yeah. with the rubber backs. Or you find the pin in the bottom of yeah. your bag. I did too. And I, you know, I have even on my yellow bag my European um, pin bag because <laughs> I'm so posh. <laughs> so posh. That's a bougie move. Yeah, that's there. a bougie. Yeah, that's a a bougie knitting bag. But it's a. Uh, the BME and I have all my pins from EYF and I don't want to lose them, you know? They're like, they're my faves. And they're one of a kind. This is my accessories bag right now. Feel how heavy it is. Is your lip gloss in there? Of course, but I have soap and I how have- How many then? Like six soaps. <laughs> Scissor. I have a lot of stuff in here. We're not going to go through there. What we'll salt? save that for another day because yeah. it smells good. I don't know. I collect the tough woolen soaps. Every time I go to an event, I buy like four of them. So, we are having a knit along, as we've said previously in the last three podcasts. We're having we a have knit along rules now. There are rules, and there's a whole bunch of stuff going on. But I put it all. I linked it all in our Ravelry okay. group. So if you want to go to our Ravelry group, I was just filling Miriam, and she knew about the knit along, but she didn't know the name of it. And, and then the name of it is the, the L Y S Unity Local Yarn Shop Unity <laughs> Knit Along. Right. So. so um, Gemma and I were talking about doing a knit along for Ryan back and then when I met uh, um, Kathy and Heather Kathy and Heather at TNNA I said why don't you join in on the knit along it'll be fun like you know we'll do something and they were like oh great idea and then a few other yarn shops have joined in I think Black Mountain Yarn Shop the knitting place um, Dinah and Pam mm -hmm. and I know a nice and knit joined okay I think uh, if I'm leaving anyone out, I'll link it below because I'm I've, I've just my brain spinning because I have so much on my mind. But you know, and it's Saturday, and it's Saturday. I'm not in podcast mode, so um, it really is different. What on Saturday? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I feel totally. Out You're of out of whack, right? Out of Everybody's yeah. a little fachaded. Yeah. Yeah, fachaded. You better drink uh -oh. your gin. I, you know, I noticed I haven't said it a lot in a couple of podcasts. I've so she probably it hasn't been. Yeah, you have. <laughs> I say it every day. So that's our knit along. And what you do is we're all knitting Tecumsehs for Rhinebeck. If you're not going to Rhinebeck, you could knit a sweater. Um, we're, and even if you're going to Rhinebeck, you don't have to make you, it Tecumseh. You don't have to make it Tecumseh if you have, there's like really light rules. It's not, there's not really rules, but we do have a lot of prizes. I think Machete Shop is donating a prize. Ooh. I think Primrose is donating a prize. There's a, look at you. All I'm like, excited. Oh, I'm going to oh, finish now. <laughs> oh wait, I can't do it. I'm one no, of the hosts. Sure. Yeah. Darn. Yeah. That's unfortunate for you. <laughs> it is. It's okay. I will take pictures of all the prizes. I'll put them up on my wall and pretend. That is so funny. FOMO. Um, FOMO. So it's going to be fun. The rules are all in our uh, Ravelry group. They're not really rules. They're just guidelines, I think. Um, if you have a Tecumseh that you've started already or you have a Rhinebeck sweater you started already, hop in. You don't have to exclusively buy the yarn from us. 
you could buy it. I think um, a few people are making kits for the Tecumsehs. Mm -hmm. I made kits. I'll have them up by the time this podcast is up. Um, I cast it on last night for my Tecumseh. It starts from August 1st through Rhinebeck weekend. I think the weekend, the that week after Rhinebeck, we'll be pulling the prizes. Danielle. Gemma Darlings Daily has it in her Ravelry group as well, so you can check that. I've linked that below. Okay. I just said a lot of information. I think you I did. just had to take a breath. I might have to have a sip of my collagen now. <laughs> While she's You're doing, really doing that, <gasps> you guys, talk about this. I tried it on. As soon as she tried it on, I was like, get it off. I want to try it. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So, we're almost there. Ignore all my strange It's ends. stunning. Now, I have a sleeve. sleeve. It's so gorgeous. It is. It really so is so much. gorgeous. I am so excited to have it finished. So excited that I tried to knit it yesterday on our camp trip to iPlay America. And it was, oh, it was bad. Yeah. And you know what? It was raining, so we had to keep the windows on the school bus oh, closed. That's right. it and was school raining. buses don't have air conditioning. They're hot. So I had mohair stuck to my hands. It was in Were my doing mouth. This? I was, I was doing that. I was trying to pick it off my tongue. It was just, yeah. it, was it, was, disaster. it was a disaster. And I didn't follow the directions and it wasn't working out. I couldn't figure out why it wasn't working out. That's beautiful. And then it's I went gorgeous. back and looked at the directions. I am so very excited. I dyed up, I've been dyeing up um, kits for it. Oh, good. So they're ready to roll. Good. As soon as she's ready with the pattern. She being getting pearly with it, Nancy, Nancy. Reese. Reese. Reese? Reese. I don't know. Reese? I'm trying to think of, I'm trying to think of how she pronounced it when she talked about her husband Reese. and his house music Reese. and I don't remember. But yeah, so That's what's beautiful. been kicking my butt is that Judy's surprisingly or Jenny's surprisingly stretchy by off. Because you have to do a reverse yarn over. I can barely do a regular yarn over, so I'm all you're fachaded. Totally fachaded with that. But Vanessa, I think I you better enough, drink again. I got enough stretch, so we're good to go. And by the next podcast, it will be finished. I can't wait. It might be too warm to wear. You know what? You wear that, I'll wear my Sipola, and we're good to go. Okay. My Sipola is almost done. Okay, I, that's I perfect then. I plan on putting it on sh a string. Yarn, spare yarn, and trying it on. I just haven't had an extra 10 minutes to do that because it's like one of those things that you just don't feel like doing. It's hard when yeah. it's like 80 degrees and incredibly humid so to uh, deal with wool. Yeah, it's, it's been really gross around here. So I didn't try that on, but I should be done. I think I might have an inch left. Bind off on those sleeves. Speaking of binding off on the Look sleeves, at this. How cute. this is my Loopy Mango uh, Perfect Summer Top. Uh, the sleeves were supposed to be longer, and I did them longer on my white one, but yeah, right. I think they're really I, cute I like just, that. I, I literally picked up knit three rows, and I, I don't even think I did. I picked up, I think I did two rows, and then did the ribbing for the bind up, because I just wanted it it's short sleeve. If you have, I don't know, I kind of wanted it short, so oh, it it's good. super cute. I really like it a lot. I, it is short. You know, like I'm wearing high-waisted pants, yes. but it's definitely cropped because I didn't knit it long <laughs> enough, but it's all right. It's all good. And speaking yeah. of knitted, I love this. Oh, oh my gosh. This is Kobuk by Caitlin Hunter. Hunter. And this is one of my new colorways for fall. So this is like a little sneak peek. It's not succulent garden. It's pistachio. I have it written down somewhere. So this is the bo uh, Kobuk and... Isn't that gorgeous? And it is doubled fingering. That pom pom is everything. Does double that not fing match? Is it just it's double, double fingering, fingering or is there mohair with involved? Mo. Oh yes, with a little um, mohair. Right. So it's double fingering with mohair. It uses DK with mohair, okay. but we just wanted to try it and test it with the doubling the fingering double fingering with the mohair so and i'm good. thinking when i finish my chelsea sweater do you have left i will have left you I, just my, nana susan my mom always likes for you to make a matching hat and it might look a little funny if you make a matching hat wear the sweater and a cowl like that might be a little much but i mean just saying if you want to do that you can go for it i was thinking i was thinking about it because i will either that or i was looking at those um oh it's the uh 
is it Midori House that did the ranunculus? Oh yeah. So I was looking at those patterns, trying to find something because I know I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna have at least a full skein, probably a skein and a half of oh, really? left over. So I was trying to see if I could do something with it. With the you you mean you have the peaches and cream? Peaches and cream, yes. But not the single. Um, I will have a skein of this single. I should have a full skein of single. I don't think I'm going to need to no, break into it. So then you can it. do the Koba. I could yeah. do the Koba, and it's like, oh, I could even do a whole like lacy mohair sweater. Now we're like no. stretching it a little bit, you but think? you know, okay. you can. I mean, you I can if you want. <laughs> if you want to make it cropped, it's all good. On really big needles, cropped on big needles. Yeah. I might be able to pull it off. We'll see. Yeah. Okay, well the Kobuk is a definite. I love that. Now we have yeah. to. I have to find a pom pom that'll go because that's perfect. So last night I did. I cast it on for my for my Tecumseh. I have two wonky balls. This one is really wonky. <laughs> this he one's looking out. pretty wonky too. It is right. Tad was freaking out when he saw this red bank mic. That is. And I cast it on. I did the ribbing. I got gauge on a. Well, I got gauge on a five and a six. Does this ever happen to you where you get the gauge on two needles? No? No. Okay, well, I got gauge on a five and a six. So I was like, well, what am I going to do? I'm not going down. I'm going up. <laughs> so it is a little loose, but I'm all for the loose knitting. Now, is the ribbing done on the same size? No, as the, the ribbing line? is done on a different size, but okay. I didn't have near me and so I didn't want to get up. a design feature there uh -huh. that you're making? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So already I modded it by, um, you're supposed to go down a needle size, use a five, and I didn't have a 16 inch. I've noticed that all Caitlin's patterns, the, the top you're casting on, you kind of need a 16 inch. And my fancy dancy Indian, whatever this is, I don't have a small, that's one thing I have to get at Rhinebeck is I need some smaller cords. Okay. Yeah, so put I put that on the list. I put that on the list. So I started this. I got in Edinburgh. This is my pink hazel um, circular. Holder. I'm not in love with it. It's not really a circular. It's a needle case. I'm not really in love with this style I love of the a, fabric. Though. The fabric, fabric is, is everything and gorgeous. But I'm not. I'm not sure if my needles. Cause then I. I don't know. I'll play around with it. I'll play around with it. I missed the Fat Squirrel update last night, by the way. Oh, there was one last night? Yeah. I, 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 I was like, oh, it's tonight. Oh, it's tonight. And then I went upstairs, did 14 things, and completely forgot. And, you know, well, here we are. Courtesy of our friend Christy Glass, when she did her bag of Palooza. Oh, you got that? She mentioned oh. the Fat Squirrel I had a pre-order. So, oh, she yes. did? I missed that. So I've had this Thanks for a while. Look. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm feeling bad now. No, don't. I have like four. We're good. This is my second. If we get so into really needles excited. up, I'll oh, get that's what I want. One. Yeah. That's I think on my needles up list is to get a fat squirrel bag. Yeah. Because what I'm realizing, I have a bajillion project bags, but I don't have a lot of bags that are sweater size. Yeah, you need sweater size because you know you're only making sweaters. That's it. I'm now a sweater knitter. Those yeah. socks. She's a yeah, they're sitting knitter. on the needles. So all those <laughs> cute little drawstrings. Yeah. I'll get yeah. back to those. Yeah. Well, well right now we're over socks. We're all about sweaters now. Yes. Sweaters and hats. So this is the yarn for my. That's a beautiful bag. Knitting. That's gorgeous. So we're to come, sir. Are you? So. So we've had so many requests for the um, live podcast. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be. So I ordered bags. You ordered bags. Uh huh. Okay. I'm so excited. Now I have to start on the yarn. Okay. So I have to start dyeing up the yarn. Wait, so if Mariah comes to the live podcast, will she get a bag? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I ordered project style bags. Okay. And then we'll put them in the Chelsea yarns, like bags that we have. Wait, what? Huh? You're going to put a bag within a bag? Yeah, because we'll have swag in the bag. You got to have swag. So we're, do oh, we're doing swag. We're doing swag. We got to have swag. So... How many people? I'm telling you, people You're coming so from bad. distances. I, it, it stresses me out to I, think I of that. Don't stress out. We, if they come from around the corner, I'm okay. No. Nope. Do you think? Do you think we're gonna have to say like, Shh, <laughs> this is a live studio audience? <laughs> <laughs> no, we're gonna let the podcast go out live, or we're gonna do our usual film 
and edit later. No, we're going to film and edit. Especially oh, with you this are? One. Yeah. Um, no. <laughs> you yeah. want to do live? We're going live. We're going yeah, live, live? live. But then oh, we have to answer questions, and I don't know how to do that. What do you mean? Hello. Well, you better, you, you better, best figure it out. Okay. I don't if you do, live, do we have a date? Just, huh? I believe we're doing September 30th, but she's waiting on, uh, on a prior okay. commitment. That, that's, the... that's there or not. But uh, I believe it's September 30th. Does that work? Um, that's I, not Nana's I, birthday. I, is it Nana's birthday? Well, she'll have to have a special seat in the front yeah. row. Well, we'll, we'll have closing to give her a the store. Okay, well, that's it. You guys have. Uh, Schedule yeah. drinks afterwards. I yeah. Mean, these, schedule this, drinks. This we have to we schedule going? drinks. Well, we can't have I mean. them. If it's not on the schedule, we can't have them. I'm concerned now. <laughs> we, well, we're having. A... But. Um, well, hold on. We got to edit it. Like, oh my god. That's and then I saw it. Actually, Actually, it was like, okay. I, I got to do it a little now. bragging while we're here. <laughs> did you clean it out? I did yeah. all that? Are stuff. we back? Or yeah, no? we're back. Oh, okay, we're back. But all that came. I'm doing real work. Real work? It took 56 Real men's work? years. Yeah, I've cleaned out entire garage. Are you 56? I'm old. You're almost 60. <laughs> okay, but is that bad? Right. Don't look at me. <laughs> look, Don't look at me. Look, I, I had a kid guess my age 60. yesterday. I was not yeah. happy at all. You, you guessed it? Yeah. Little girl looked at me. She said, yeah, I'm not even going to say the number because I'm not giving that <laughs> stuff up. However, I was so taken aback. It was like, really? And then I'm thinking about it because, like, okay, this is a kid. So to a kid, anybody over like twenty five, TJ right. thinks is twenty two is old. So yeah. it's like okay. And then one of the other kids like dropped a number that was twenty years younger. I was like, yes, your number is the prize winner. I like your number so much better. Oh my but, yeah, I was I was so it taken aback. It was like oh, that's it, a riot. I'm gonna have to go home and get out my face cream that my mother always said. My mother would say, just get me the same face cream you use. And I'd say, but I don't use any. And she'd oh, look at me big. and do the, well, it shows. Oh. Yeah, she was rough. She was rough. Well, in her 90s and looking for face cream. <laughs> there you go. You are officially dating the sugar dad. Uh-oh. Okay. Okay. So she likes pinks and purples, but she wound up taking this color choice. Oh, she, she got two. So it's three colors? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's yeah. three skeins. These are 100% um, merino, not super wash. They're not super wash. No. So it's three colors, yep. one skein of each. Yeah, isn't that cool? Oh, that is really cool. That so that's oh, cool. I did three purpley type of colors that's too. That's interesting. But I would mix it with the natural and maybe another color. Yeah. This is my uh, Yeah, this is your favorite. Yeah. So that's that. That's the golden hour. And then, oh, so this is, I'm going, I didn't, the delivery should be here today. We were a little bit late um, on the, uh, we were supposed to get it yesterday, but our, something happened with our delivery, so we'll have it to, today. This is the new FET. I always think oh. someone's saying FRET. <laughs> From but Wolf this Oak. is the new wool folk. It's unbelievable. I'm going to insert a photo below of, um, I can't wait to see the patterns they come out with. Yeah, they're beautiful. Me. And it's like a worsted weight, and it's a nub, but it looks like it's like a, it's, it, it looks, looks like, like it's a, a almost fur. Almost like a boucle, mm -hmm. is that the fancy name for yeah. it? Yeah, but this, but it's not really a boucle because people don't, we don't, we don't really like boucle because yeah, boucle can be kind of itchy. This That's is super soft. wool folk. But I'm going to insert a photo of the shawl actually i'll show it on here because i could also insert it but i could show you so you can see it i um antonia was here this week and i took photos of her sh I, I was wearing her shawl look at that whoa is that not stunning that is, look at that so i'm gonna wow. show you guys look at it it's stunning in this color it's and it's eight skeins it's beautiful. So I needed my photographer here, but I didn't have him. So I had to do the photos by myself, but I'll, I'll link them inside. They're gorgeous. It's gorgeous. That yarn is beautiful. I love wolf look and everything about it. So, so that's that. So that's uh, the new wool folk. We did get a Tosh delivery of Tosh Chunky, something that we haven't had in a while. 
So we have all these chunky uh, colors. These I are kind fun of, colors, aren't too. they? I kind of got uh, these are all the new colors. I got whatever new color she had. I got those. So I got the chunky is really nice. I was thinking I re I ordered. I pulled aside for a car bath. <laughs> if I knit my Tecumseh, so that we'll be, see. But, and that's cropped. So the that's carbeth? always a good one. Yes, the carbeth is cropped. We like cropped. We cropped do. seems like it's a big hit now, right? It does. Dolman sleeves and cropped Dolman seem to be the things. Yeah, and mouth. <laughs> everybody, everybody has jumped on Everyone the mouth bandwagon, which I love. Oh, no. Interesting. So, um... <laughs> My hair is a little flat today. Okay. We got new fairy hair, guys. We did. Mm -hmm. Somebody tried. Ugh, one of those darn counselors. It camp comes up behind me, and he's like, "Oh, I thought you had something in your hair." <gasps> I'm like, it's my fairy hair. I like your new color. You got pumpkin spice and pink. Um, no, actually, I didn't get the pumpkin you spice. Got I got copper. I yeah, like copper, and I think it's magenta. I think maybe? I have some copper too. I think I have some copper. Yeah, because I had the magenta. That was the it. Magenta. Those, that color looks really yes. pretty. I so, see it. It's like the pink. Yeah. So this yarn with my magenta. I would like your wool and honey. This color. I think so too. I think that would be really nice. Yeah. I think that would be perfect. Do we have anything else? I think we're good. And you, um, we do. We will have. Oh. So yeah. pretty. For the sheep. No, they're bones. color. They weren't color. No, they, these are color. These are full color. That's a Kahuna cool. bag. Are they all for sheep or wool? Yeah. That's a you great jealous? logo too. And that yeah. That Red Bank Mike yeah. guy is really uh, These are just working. our samples, so. But Red Bank Mike, he's something else. Yeah. And we have new pins and Red Bank Mike has, has an Red Bank Mike has an enamel pin that needs two backs. Stop mm -hmm. it. Yeah, I swear. Because it's a big kahuna. Uh -huh. I can't. I it's can't. Huge. Yeah, it's <laughs> awesome. So we're going to have the big uh, kahuna really. on the pen. That's so fun. Yeah. Oh, are these new? Can we talk about Oh, these? yeah. Oh, Aren't they so pretty? pretty? They're hand painted. Look at this. Aren't they oh, my so goodness. pretty? That's beautiful. It's a beautiful wooden yarn bowl. I could sit and drink my water bottle. You could. Yeah. The only thing I don't like about the Nalgene, it's like. Does your nose fit in? Is it supposed to? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. For so oh, I thought you wanted me to put my nose in there. Yeah. <laughs> TJ got some contraption. Of course he did. That you know, like it's some fancy sippy thing for his Nalgene. Of course. So funny. <laughs> so funny. So my Fetty had a bad experience yesterday. <laughs> I heard it was you so said. sad. I was saying, Sandy by the lakeside was saying that she had to order a Yeti. She said it's all about, she said it's all about Fuji's, or she said Gucci's and Yeti's, and then spell check auto corrected her for the uh, Gucci. She said, I mean Fuji. <laughs> so she said she ordered um, a, a Yeti. I don't think she ordered a Fetty. She I didn't order she, a Fetty. I think she might have ordered a Yeti, but what happened to your Yeti? Uh, my my Fetty, my little uh, flamingo Fetty sitting on the edge of the table and the kids were playing ball in the room. And I got like 35 kids in that room. It's just a recipe for disaster. And the next thing I know, somebody hit my Fetty. Fetty with my iced tea in it. So, you know, that's like the 30 ounce oh. rambler. I had probably 24 ounces of iced tea all over the classroom floor. That's why you need that click top. And click. you know what? It chipped the top. Mm. So now I have to get the slidey top. I wonder because... if it'll fit on the Fetty. <laughs> it, it should. <laughs> Come on. Is it like one size fits all? I think it is. <laughs> That's yeah. so funny. So I'm going to have to break down and, and bust out the 9.99 for the uh, Magnus <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, we've been trying to order the Fetties for the last like two weeks since you sent me the link. It disappeared. Did the link disappear? I think actually, if you go to the Yeti website and you click on sale, you can find them there. But no, really? no, 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 not from my computer because when I go on my <laughs> computer, I go to the regular Yeti site. But I think that the one that you're linking through, you think mine's a G Fab <laughs> site? <laughs> Just saying. Definitely. Okay. Because okay. Yeti doesn't sell the flamingo one. I'm dying. Wait. Oh my god. 
That is so we're, good. we're gonna have to find. Yeah, we have to. Goes. It's only Mariah on her wants phone. the unicorn. Yeah. Oh, I want a unicorn one too. The unicorn is kind of um. Whimsical. I need more <laughs> mugs because this isn't enough now. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Wait, got another one over there. This is no, ridiculous. Really, yeah, this is what we should watch around. Miranda has this one at home. So Mariah saw it and Mariah's like, Mom, did you bring Christina's mug home? Look like, at this. No, this it's is Miranda's. insanity. That's a lot going on there. That's a lot of beverages there. That is so a lot of beverages. this is mint water. Look at her face. Watch her face, guys. Water. This is mint water I know, it's coming lemon. up. Um, <laughs> this is collagen. This is empty because I have to wash it. And this is my almond milk latte. You don't like almond milk, do you? I do like almond milk. Yeah? I like the dark chocolate sweet in the almond milk. That's you the can't good drink stuff. That. That's not good for you. I know. But that's the one I like. <laughs> you say, I do like that one. It's delicious. Tad does too. What? The, the dark, dark chocolate. chocolate. Almond, almond milk. milk. Yeah, it's pretty, I mean. Right? It's good stuff. It, yeah, it's, yeah, it is. I mean, it's, no Elvis today? I don't know where he went. Back to Tennessee. Um, actually, I gotta find this. This is pretty funny. I'm trying to do the right uh, They're waiting. Oh, who's waiting? So, the oh, people. Um, the viewers. Oh, yeah. I, I, I keep thinking we're just <laughs> oh, sitting here I'm talking. I'm Miriam. This is Christina. I keep, we're I in the keep Chelsea we're here. Pearls. Yeah. We're, that we're just here talking. We'll link all that below in case you don't know. And that bell thing that you were talking about last week? You know, the ring the bell? So. Meg? Uh, someone emailed me and said they 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 clicked the bell, so they were all fired Look at up. Meg, they were in Meg's favorite step. She was just at Graceland. No, she was. Yes, yeah, she was. Oh, she sent me that. Goodness, yep. that is a riot. Yeah, that's hysterical. She is so funny. She texts me like she sends me DMs like all the time. We talk all the time. She is a riot. Is I she love her. She just went yeah. to Graceland. Yeah, she was. Just she's going to ride back. Yeah, she, oh, good. We're, we're totally. She's she's making gotta, cookies. I'm doing the Kahuna handoff there. She watched the last podcast and someone a cookie hand a kahuna handoff or a cookie handoff? Kahuna. Are you trading for cookies? I already I mean well no 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 I'm not trading the kahuna the cookies just move you up probably higher are. on the list. He probably yeah. has some scam underneath yeah, like, that Meg's gonna get like get, I'll give you the cookies, just give me the kahuna. Here, give me the bag, we pretend the money's in it's really the cookies. So someone on the last podcast, I literally died when I read this. I was peeing in my pants. They were calling it Cookie Gate. <laughs> cookie Gate. Yeah. It's a scandal yeah. because you can bribe yeah. your way yeah. up the list yeah. by cooking. So I like it. Dying. So Meg sends me a DM and she's like, Cookie Gate? This is hysterical. And I was like, I know. Like, is that not perfect? That is. So then someone sent me an email. I think it was Janice. She's coming to our live podcast and she said, you know, my husband makes really good brownies just saying oh they might be better than meg's cookies oh, like, oh <laughs> boy oh boy oh, oh. Uh oh it's like the smackdown like the Seriously. andrea oh yeah jody shaw oh, smackdown yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we have the cookie brownie smackdown yeah. i like awesome. it yeah. cookie gate. I like it yeah. you started a you started a trend well, I mean, first of all, there are no losers in cookie cake. Because so it's all cookies. All, cookie. all cookies are good. Everybody wins. Out. Yeah. Well, yeah, even your belly. Yeah. <laughs> Funny. Did you want to go into say something else? I'm not saying. But you were good. Yeah, well, yeah I'm not getting edited yeah. today. See? Oh. oh. Is that it? We're not getting edited today. Yeah, yeah. Oh, but last week we were? Last week you were actually good. We didn't edit it a lot. It was just you and I that we had to edit out. I went a little rogue in one of the. Uh... I'm really trying hard because I'm getting nervous for this live thing. Oh, so you are you trying to practice? Yeah. You know, so you'll yeah. be on your best behavior when yeah. we have company. Stuff comes in and Those I company just manners. think about it and then I just let it go, like in yoga. Are we going to have Chelsea Pearl's podcast balloons everywhere? I think we need you them. Figure it out. Maybe. <laughs> This is the yoga's paying off. I just thought about this, right? It's coming in my head. Ah, uh, instead of letting yoga. that big toe bother me, I'm just letting it go right. I might out. have to. <laughs> right I'm sorry. Out. I'm sorry. No one knows what the big toe is, but so we're not going to go there. We're feeling very tranquil. Yeah, it's summer. It's good. There's no stress. No stress. Johnny, no stress. Johnny, no stress. <laughs> So we covered. I think we covered all. Everything. Do we have anything topics. new? Did we talk about those yet? 
The Nick Kiss? Yeah. Have oh, we no. talked about this? They're really cute, though. I'll dive across Sandy the table. Sandy put them yeah. on the table. They're really cute. I love them. Can I unbox? Yeah. There's a purple one. These are the Nick Kits. They've been, re you guys probably remember oh, you know these. The boxes are like taped. sealed. Yeah, yes. so we don't want to open, open them. But um, <clears throat> it comes with a scissor, a stitch mark, stitch markers, measuring tape, point protectors, a darning needle, You've got um, a needle thread gauge. cutter, crochet, thread cutter, crochet hook. I mean, there's ten things in here. It's all made in the USA. They're all really cool. They're really cool. So. This family bought the company and rebranded the actual knitter's kit. Isn't that cool? Yeah, and now we've got cool colors. Yeah, purple, they come black. in purple, black, black and teal. Teal, turquoise. Teal, teal, turquoise. Teal, oh, turquoise. This color. Yeah, they're really cool. It's Tallulah teal. I like Tallulah teal. I do too. They've got cute names. I like that. Yeah, me too. So I think that's it then. We yeah. brought in that. Um, we talked about the mohair last time, right? The, yeah. The loopy mango. So yeah, we love that. that. Yes. I didn't start my sweater yet. I'm, I'm in sweater mode over here with the I know. So I'm really going to have progress for next week, so I'm so excited. I want to, we should wear our sweaters next week. Oh, no, I'm not going to put any stress on myself. Okay. You could wear yours. I could wear mine. I'm just thinking of how much sweating I'm going to be yeah. doing, rocking the we'll hair of the moment. Yeah. We'll have to crank up the air conditioner, we'll make it like a meat locker in yeah. here. <laughs> that way we can do it. Yeah, we're good. It was a meat locker in here last week when I came in. I was like, holy. <laughs> <laughs> Is that it? I think it might be. Thanks so much for watching. Yes, Here's that time where the music comes in. I'm going to do the hair thing. Um, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for if you're subscribing. not a subscriber, please subscribe. Hit the little bell for the notification. She's so fancy now. She knows. And then, well, you know why? Because I'm like on my computer doing things and down in the corner uh -huh. I get the Christy Class just posted a new, you know, whatever. I didn't realize that it does that, so I have to do that. Yeah. So that way you know, or you can click on the bell and then you'll get a drop down of the things that have happened recently um, with the podcast that you follow. That's cool. I'm going to do that. I don't do that in my regular podcast that I follow, so I'm going to do that. Gonna. Gonna? Like you going to do that? That's a good word. My, my vocabulary, my diction, everything has gone downhill in the last six months it is just like no free-for-all my biggie is i'm a i'm a big i i think i might say that too i'm gonna go over there now you know and... what i say that you say a lot um no what, what do you say you know you go mm, no i say that all the time now no it's, it's uh, a fair no. trade-off because yeah. i picked up fachaded yeah i have my fourth graders saying fachaded they do not they do oh they'll come up and say I, I don't know what happened here miss churro my documents all fachaded can you help me figure it out I'm like, yes. That's so bad so we are a really exciting news and then we can go again but really exciting news we were cleaning out the garage and literally got rid of everything in the garage and Not I have to, yeah, so it's, a good question. it's all in the back of the truck actually outside, <laughs> yeah, yeah. but for the dump, but um, I have to dye tomorrow yarn, so I'm taking off tomorrow to dye yarn and I said, oh my God, they're working on the garage. How am I going to dye? So a little trigger went off and said, wait. We don't even use our basement and it's fully finished and there's just kind of garbage down there, really nothing great. Why don't I move my dye studio into the basement? Oh, and I have air conditioning. Yeah, you've, got, you've got water, you've got a source of water oh, yeah, in there and everything. Thing. I am so excited. So TJ and I are going to Ikea on Monday and he's going to help me build everything. But tomorrow we're going to move everything down. Tad's getting nervous. She seems very yeah, and sweating because he thinks we're buying like all this stuff. But I have all the stuff ready, but now we can use it. So we're just moving into the basement. So tomorrow will be my first dye day, probably, hopefully. In your dice in, in, your dice, in my new dice studio. Nice I was thinking about yeah. renting it out to somebody. Mariah was oh. thinking that she would hide there really? for a while. Yeah. I didn't see if you noticed. <laughs> we probably wouldn't. I, I just, yeah, I mean, yeah. I went into the one room yesterday. Okay, we're gonna go. Oh, yeah. okay. Have, been have a great years. day. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, no. That's right. Oh, by the way, shout out. Oh, shout out? I can't. Uh, I can't even. <laughs>